The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Montreal, Quebec, Canada, weighing in at 212 pounds, Sammy Zayn. And here comes the underdog from the underground. If it was up to me, Sammy Zayn would stay in the underground. and I think he'll get it tonight. Make way for the Irish ace. This is gonna be good. And his opponent representing the Judgment Day from Bray, County Wicklow, Ireland, weighing in at 180 pounds, J.D. McDonough. J.D. McDonough is an Irish nobleman who walks with an air of distinction. And tonight, he's looking to throw hands. Yeah, McDonough's been on a rocket launch-like trajectory ever since entering NXT. He has these chilling eyes just to stare stares right through you and he's able to dismantle all comers mcdonough possesses skills so far beyond you have no choice but to become a believer yeah jd mcdonough loves putting the human brain and body through severe trauma this guy is pure evil Listen, he'll attack if he senses even the slightest fear or trepidation. Hey, J.D., J.D., fear and trepidation to my left. Look at Saxton. Quiet, Corey. The self-proclaimed locker room leader, Sami Zayn, ready to kick things off here. Being an honorary ooze has taken Sami Zayn's status to the next level. Always the opportunist, Sami saw that there was some mutual back scratching that could pay off once he aligned himself with the button. We'll see if the so-called affiliation Zayn has can produce any results in this match. And then we've got the Irish ace, J.D. McDonough, a true student in the art of combat. McDonough studied hard to become a gifted technician and has trained his body into a living weapon. He's also a nice cold sadist. The way McDonough smiles after taking a big hit, or how he stares at his competition like they're a piece of meat, it's just downright frightening. Sure, he's pumping himself up, but he's also giving his opponent a chance to recover. And JD gets that turn back on him. Oh, man. of a daredevil, the ability to take risk with minimal trepidation. No fear, absolute reckless abandon. Not that I want this to happen, but how does Sami Zayn earn the win tonight? The way he always does. Trust his intelligence. Sami's good at finding the surest path to victory. It isn't always pretty, and it might not always be the quote-unquote fair way, but it does work. Getting back into the ring. Reversal! What a counter! A series of reversals. Sent into the court. Hurling the kick by Sami Zayn. No doubt, Sami just ended this. Uh-oh. Look at this. Blue Thunder Bomb. Looking for the victory. Two. Oh, and a kick out. Kicked out. He kicked out. How is he still in this match? By the skin of his teeth. He gets sent down to the floor. Heads out of the ring, but needs to be mindful of the referee's count here. It's a 
let's get another look at some of the high points of that one. Here is your winner, Sammy Zayn! No other way to put it, guys. That was kind of a butt-kicking. An absolute statement by the victor here tonight. What a steamroller. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the World Heavyweight Championship. The Scottish Warrior has arrived. A multi-time world champion and a Royal Rumble winner. And to this day, one of the toughest fighters in WWE. McIntyre's has been a journey of redemption, of making up for lost time. Drew has taken titles and main events by force. Listen, he beat Brock Lesnar at WrestleMania to win the WWE Championship. He's had epic clashes with Roman Reigns, and he's stronger than ever. A decade of being WWE's freaking workhorse, and the WWE Universe is finally singing his praises. He can't make a mistake, or McIntyre will dissect him. He's got to have a flawless game plan here tonight. Introducing the challenger from Ayers, 
Scotland, weighing in at 254 pounds, the Scottish warrior, Drew McIntyre. And his opponent from Davenport, Iowa, weighing in at 217 pounds, he is the world heavyweight champion, Seth. Path doesn't matter. Here's where it counts. Here is where it's settled. The prize is on the line. Championship action underway. The champ looks as hungry and prepared here as ever. Yeah, they have absolutely no desire to even entertain the possibility of walking out of here tonight without their team. Tossed around like a rag doll. Just got thrown around like a sack of you-know-what. Setting up neck breaker position. Ooh, bang! I'll just leave it at this. Nobody comes into a match hoping to get chucked around like the Kimura. The Kimura. Kimura lock applied. Will they? Good luck getting out of this. Well, I guess that's one way to do it. King Slayer is dominating. Smart offense from Seth is keeping Drew off balance. Super delivered. The challenger's looking shaken. Answering back. McIntyre, fuck the Kimura, the Kimura! It's locked in now! Give up now! Swallow your pride! He is doing whatever he can to break the Kimura! And he does! He's one step ahead there. And a standing moonsault! And now McIntyre is being neutralized. Drew doesn't usually allow his opponents to gain this much confidence. Oh, misses the mark. The Kimura, oh, the Kimura! Kimura lock applied. Well, good luck getting out of this. I guess that's one way to do it. Wow, man. Oh, Cover by the challenger! You have to think this battle is starting to weigh down on him. and just rapid stops. Oh, just in case the first you didn't hurt, there's an the Kimura. Oh, the Kimura. An uncanny showing of power. I have no idea how he... He doesn't yeah. have much time before his arm snaps. Great job fighting out. Ah, oh. oh, jumping knee strike. Uh-oh. Barrel roll, Pepe. Just exhibiting their fearlessness. Exhibiting guts and accuracy as well. Thrown out of ringside and back to the mat. Oh, strong impact! McIntyre turns things around. Oh, yeah, the wherewithal to counter McIntyre. Drew fending him off. Manhandling! Here's a pin for the title. No, he kicks out at two and a half. Man, oh man. Oh man. Wrist clutch applied. And this is just next level brute. I think it's time for the countdown. McIntyre. Burning the tables. And responds with a counter of their own. And this might not have a pleasant ending. Right across the larynx. Oh, that was just malicious. Just disrespectful. Stop 
up in the leg. Those last hits rattled the champ. Yeah, McIntyre putting as much power as he can behind his offense. Just a ferocious... And Seth is finally able to mount some resistance with that. That's possibly the trigger for Seth to battle his way back into this. Uh-oh. Barrel tope, what? Just a devil-may-care attitude on full display. Going for broke, and it pays off. And he throws the opposition back into the ring. Oh, my God, a clothesline. Super kick. With a reversal. Oh, jumping knee strike. Lights out. Rollins lining it up. Stop. A championship level move. Rollins looking for it. Stop. The champ will stay champ. Makes the cover. Simply refusing to let this opportunity slip away. And who knows if they're being. Look out! Yeah, my toe is on that. Can it be? Will the rain continue? So Rollins keeps his title and doesn't look like it's going anywhere right now. These gentlemen get after it. Here are the highlights. She's a feared MMA grappler who is always ready to fight. The following contest is a fatal five-way match and is for the WWE Women's World Championship. Introducing the challenger from Sioux Falls, South Dakota, the Queen of Spades, Shayna Baszler. A menacing look in her eye. Michael, I think you mean terrifying? Baszler is ready to subdue any and all opposition she encounters. Baszler just absolutely loves combat in any form. You say that like it's a bad thing.
Raquel Rodriguez, a massive presence in the women's division. And from Rio Grande Valley, Texas, Raquel Rodriguez. And NXT Rodriguez won the first ever Women's Dusty Rhodes Tag Team Classic for the first ever NXT Women's Tag Team Champions. Well, Cole, you can bet Raquel has some more firsts in store for the main roster. The personification of dominance in NXT and WWE since day one. Yeah, I think we can all agree that Raquel Rodriguez is getting better with every match. Even when she makes short work of her opponent. A force to be reckoned with in the women's division. And from Ayrshire, Scotland, Piper. Well, lately, Dewdrop has developed a serious edge to her. You're right, Byron, and I like it. Dewdrop is doing what she has to do to stop the competition. I tell you, there are some times when Dewdrop seems unstoppable inside that ring. Plenty of power in her game. A woman who calls herself undeniable. She certainly lived up to that moniker thus far. And from Utah, Zoe Stone. This is a tough, tough woman. No doubt, Zoe Stark, one of the hardest hitters in the women's division, also battled back from a devastating torn ACL to reestablish her spot in NXT. She calls herself undeniable. Well, it's time to prove it. I have every bit of confidence that she will. The Eradicator has arrived. Ready to pass judgment on the women's division. Presenting the Judgment Day from Adelaide, Australia. She is the WWE Women's World Champion, Rhea Ripley. Rhea's had plenty of accolades. She's held the NXT UK and the NXT Women's Championship. Now, such an impressive resume for Rhea Ripley, but man, is she intimidating. Yeah, it's no easy task to face down Rhea Ripley. Always ready to eradicate any obstacle in her way. The ice-cold expression on her face tells you all you need to know about Rhea Ripley. Rhea has complete confidence in herself. A fully confident challenger in their quarter. Absolutely hell-bent on capturing the title.
As if this match wasn't compelling enough. When you throw in the no disqualification stipulation, it gets even better. These competitors can use barricades, steel stairs, announce tables, heck, even outside interference. Nothing is off limits here, and they will let their imaginations run wild. You're right, Corey. This is hardcore all the way, and the WWE Universe can't get it up on it. Running leg drop. Oh, shot right to the kidney. Counter from Stark. Finds a counter from Stark. Spine buster. Could lead to a big time win. Face first in the turnbuckle. She slips outside. What has she got in mind? Crippling attack on the knee. Oh, we know what's coming up next. Ripley's got her hook for Rift Tie. The title's going nowhere. Kiss your dreams. Good night. Well scattered reversal there. She throws her back in. Nasty one right to the chest. Oh, oh, She's got an answer for that. Now a pen for the championship. Oh, and a kick out. Is somebody tell me what it's going to take to put her away? Ooh, what a forearm club. Challenges a little worse for wear now. Raquel has nothing but absolute destruction on her mind. She's getting herself in the zone, but she shouldn't hesitate much longer. We just saw with that attack. Like, watch out! Oh God, that, that, that's a bad landing. An absolutely foolhardy decision made there. That could be very costly. I don't know if the risk is worth it. Just one run right after the other. Can't be no way. Slingshot cross body to the outside. Big boy. Ooh, merciless looking blow. Sit straight into the barricade. Evades their offense. Safe. She heads into the ring. Drop that bow. Hook kick on target. Raquel beats her to the punch. Brilliant countering by both competitors. Oh, tossed hard into the ring post. Double. Ripley has things right where she wants them. Here we go. Rip time. I think the champ's got it. Cover. Two. Oh, I can't get out. How did she do that? How in the world? And she knew Ripley's game plan. No two ways about this. Zoe Stark wants a fight. Able to reverse that one. Champ has this one in hand now. There's 
the knife edge chop and now continuing the attack on the knee. Straight to the knee. Oh, impressive counter. Each superstar trying to stay a step ahead. That's a free throw. of the year. Let's take another look at some of the action. Here is your winner. And still, WWE Women's World Champion, Rhea That's the kind of win that can take their career to the next level. This win might have put her ahead of the pack. She certainly grabbed the spotlight with this victory. Here comes the street champion. The following is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, representing the bloodline from Las Vegas, Nevada, weighing in at 223 pounds, Solo Sikoa. Had a meteoric rise in NXT, multiple main event matches, and the NXT North American title and has already made an impact on the main roster, becoming a part of the bloodline. 
Tall task ahead for this superstar facing one of the greatest of all time in John Cena. The greatest, Saxton. The greatest. Quite simply, the greatest of all time, John Cena. And his opponent from West Newbury, Massachusetts, weighing in at 251 pounds, John Cena! No doubt about it, the absolute greatest of all time. Yeah, nobody has been on top longer, and nobody has changed the game more. You can't debate Cena's achievements, but you have to wonder, has Hollywood softened Big Match John? A superstar like John Cena, obviously his reputation precedes him. There's a reason he's called Big Match John. Yeah, there is no such thing as a small match when Cena's involved. The lights are even brighter, the WWE Universe is even louder, and the intensity is off the charts. It is all a spectacle, courtesy of one man, and his name is John Cena. Cena clearly focused and ready for this big match to really get underway. And then there's Solo Sokoa, a superstar who is a part of a legendary family legacy in this industry. He's a born fighter who spent his early years battling on the streets. That's why he's known as the street champ. Those experiences gifted Solo with incredible toughness and a no-quit attitude. Once he sets his sights on a target, the street champ never backs down. Looking at this matchup here, Corey. What do you think John Cena needs to do to find a way to win? I think C Oh, look out! Oh, leg drop from the top rope! Are you kidding me? And he only stays down for a one count. Refusing to give up even an inch of ground as this match continues. Counters that. Spinning heel kick! He turns it around. Didn't go as solo picture. And misses on the springboard. Oh, right to the kidneys. Golly. Vicious, downright savage club right there. The damage he's taken. So Cole spinning solo. Solo can end this now. Pulled in for a belly to belly. Momentum clearly on the side of Sokoa. Solo is stifling the opposition now. Oh, no. Oh, stop right to the gut. Yeah. Oh, my gosh, what impact. Uh-oh. Cena warning him off. Cena's never give up attitude, shining through once again. To the kidneys. Oh, and finds a counter. Close lines. Good oh, lord. So effective. No! Oh, the high risk doesn't pay off. Wildly throwing your body out of the ring like that is more often than not gonna provide such a result. That was an example of boldness backfire. Okay, already we get it. Stop looking for adulation for the crowd and get back into the fight. Solo Sokoa casting an intimidating look out at the fans. He's got the answer. Here's Cena. Oh, a adjustment. Feeling like it's over for Sokoa. 
These superstars put on quite a show. Here Here's another look. John Cena! The following contest is scheduled for... Ladies and gentlemen, the social media icon has arrived. Well, love him or hate him, his career is off to an amazing start. You're right, Saxton. This guy nearly ended the 800-plus day universal title reign of Roman Reigns in just his third match. You gotta keep up the attack, but never underestimate Rey Mysterio. Easier said than done, Rey Mysterio, the greatest underdog in the history of the game. Now, this is gonna be good. Without a doubt, one of the greatest Lucha Libre stars in sports entertainment history. Break out your notepads because we are about to receive a master class in high flying. One of the all-time greats, listen to the ovation for the biggest little man in the history of WWE, Rey Mysterio. You gotta love an underdog story like Rey Mysterio's. It sounds nice, but I wouldn't know. I've never been an underdog in my life. Introducing the challenger from Cleveland, Ohio, weighing in at 185 pounds, Logan Paul. And his opponent from San Diego, California, weighing in at 175 pounds, he is the WWE United States Champion, Ray
This is all for the highly decorated United States Championship. Harley Race, the inaugural champion, truly a tough man's title. There is a certain excitement that a United States Championship match has. It's hard to nail down exactly what it is. I know what you mean, Byron. Whether defending or challenging for the U.S. title, superstars seem to go the extra mile. Oh, right to the kidneys. Golly. A picture-perfect moonsault. A move like that is what sets you apart from other superstars. DDT! Look out! Oh, an inverted DDT! Ray just can't stop this attack. Ray's gotta find a way to defend himself. Using the elbow as a weapon. Dropkick hits the mark. Going right after the neck. Down a neck breaker. A great counter. Mysterio fending that off. He's able to fend off the attack. was definitely not thinking about finesse with that one. Was only thinking about dominance. Mysterio's success is not limited to a division or type of competition. Corey, how has Mysterio made a career of defeating opponents of all shapes and sizes? Mysterio's reinvented his training regimen, so the emphasis on cardio, flexibility, and core strength. Mysterio's ability to adapt on the ground and in the air are second to none. error there. Hooked up. Oh. <sighs> Off. Forearm all across the face. Elbow drop. Knee crusher. Just relentless. Just punishing. Logan Paul delivers a with a skull crushing finale. Gonna see a new champ. Straight right. Good night. The champ looking worn out and hanging tough, but beginning to show some wear and tear. Might want to think about picking up the pace a bit. Overwhelming offense now from Paul. Yeah, Paul is proving hard to keep up with. And Paul caught by surprise. Going right after the neck. Neck breaker. Rolling neck snap. Oh, man. Targeting the arm to great effect. Oh, what a snap there. Oh, perfectly executed. Here's a snap mare. And a basement drop kick. And Paul is being picked apart here. We're seeing Mysterio's adaptability on display. Pinpoint attacks in the air and on the mat are paying off the Ray thus far. He paid for that one. Oh, man, big time. And Ray had it scouted. Ray managing to find some of Champ, we're going to end this. A long two and a half in the waning moments of this match. Oh, ouch. Ah, striking with an A. Things getting very real for Logan Paul as he starts to bleed. Low drop kick hits the target. Amazing grace from Rey Mysterio. This is Logan Paul's perseverance getting tested. Mysterio. Suicide. Oh, straight to the floor. Brash decision making there proved to be extremely detrimental. Can you recover from such an error? You have to wonder.
basement. I've got a foot to the face for you. Counter upon counter. Great minds thinking alike. Look at this heel hook. This is how you punish your opponent, and he's enjoying every minute of it. Everything working against Logan Paul now. Nothing can slow Rey Mysterio down. This is just ruthlessness personified. Forearm all across the face. Oh, he retaliates. Oh, Rey Mysterio. Look at this. Turnbuckles. What's he gonna do? He wants it one more time. Frog splash from Rey Mysterio. Now that is why they're the champ. Rey Mysterio withstood the challenge like a champion. These guys feel no love for each other. Here's another look. Here is your winner. And still, WWE. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the WWE Women's Championship. The EST is here. This is going to be good. Cole Byron's like the EST of the commentary team. The worst? The dumbest. The ugliest. Hey, that, that, those are dumb examples. Watch what you say. Just signature exuberant energy. Now, Belair is always ready for her next... Introducing the challenger from Knoxville, Tennessee, Bianca. The champion came out here somewhat gloating their belt around. Don't know if that's their way of playing mind games. That title should give anyone the right to gloat. Look, what good is it being on top of the mountain if you don't get to look down on everybody else? That is a sad attitude to have. EO with a turnaround. Could be trouble lurking for her with this submission maneuver. You can see the agony on her face. This is hip tossing her way out of a bad situation. 
Tossed into the corner. She managed. Shoulders down. Championship on the line. The champ kicks out easily. This one isn't going to be ended quite so easily. And look at this now. Bad intentions coming with this hole. Oh, look at this. Is she going to... Hip tossing her way out of a bad situation. Massive double foot stomp. Eel bursts to the top rope. Ooh. Ooh. Big miss right there. Ooh, what a forearm club. She's trying so desperately to get back up to her feet. Look out! Oh, no! Tempted fate and paid dearly for it. Don't do it! And now gets tossed into the ring. She heads out of the ring, but she needs to pay attention to the ref's count. Unbelievable athleticism. Showing off the quickness. That'll turn things around in a hurry. She will wisely return to the ring now. It's the mark. We know that Bianca Belair uses every moment in the ring to prove herself the EST. You can prepare physically for Bianca, but how do you prepare mentally for her, Corey? While Bianca is one amazing superstar to behold, it's the constant need to prove herself that can be her downfall. If you can frustrate Belair, she may start second-guessing herself, and then you have to capitalize on any opportunity that presents itself. That stretch could lead to a snap. Right across the knee. Heel oh. up locked in. This is painful. And Eo is in command. Belair seemingly second-guessed herself as she finds herself at a disadvantage here. Eo Sky with a double underhook hoists her opponent way up and driven down with a face buster. She was clearly waiting for that. Boom, nice. Look at this incredible power. The Gorilla Press. Wow. Beautiful moonsault. <laughs> wow, did that just happen? The champ getting put on the back foot here. Crucial moment. Bang! What a knee. Oh, goodness, that was bad. Trying their opponent's arm out. There's a double stop right down on the arm. And what a hit. She goes to the outside. Look out! Suicide dive! Absolutely throwing 